Responding to comments on YouTube, the Tucker Carlson thing actually got published there, not on TikTok for some reason. Ending the freedom of the press, okay. Fox News is not the press. They are entertainment. They uh, clearly stated that in court. You could shut them down completely and it wouldn't affect the press. Republicans endanger almost all of our rights because they always abuse them. They're like that bad kid in school who gets your recess taken away. And when it comes to freedom of speech, they took it to mean freedom to lie for money, oftentimes coming from foreign governments like Russia. Mark Zuckerberg, we know he took a lot of money from Russia to radicalize people against Black Lives Matter back in the Obama era. So because they took it as freedom to lie, that endangers our freedom of speech. Next up, Tucker Carlson may be an asshole, but not a terrorist, obviously. If we split those unnecessary coronavirus deaths and divided them equally from all the fake newsers who push their anti-vax, anti-mask propaganda, Tucker Carlson killed at least 50,000 Americans. My uncle is paralyzed because of those fake newsers. And there's children in my family. They're being offered as sacrifices to the Trump cult. They're not getting vaxxed even after what happened to my uncle. If that's not a terrorist, I don't know what the hell is. Nope, I'm a Democrat. Well, honestly, I don't even believe that, but... This video is anti-democracy. Are you kidding? You know what they're trying to do? They're trying to permanently take our right to vote away. And they almost got away with it already in, on January 6th. And it's no, so obvious that they, they're trying to gear up and get ready to do it again. This is very close to the incitement of violence. No, I never told anybody to go out and do anything. I'm talking about when I become president what i'm going to do on my platform which is to fight these terrorists treat these terrorists like terrorists quit acting like joe biden these people who want to decapitate him he's just wants to hold hands and sing kumbaya and he basically has his own version of donald trump's there's good people on both sides when he says don't question these terrorist intent being Republican doesn't make you a racist person. I don't know, that might have been true before Donald Trump, but when you elect a racist person who's clearly racist, it really does make you a racist person. I mean, think about how dumb that is. That's like saying that you were part of the Nazis, but not one of the bad Nazis, the good ones. And look at all these white supremacists and anti-semitics that they're sending to office so yeah when the civil war breaks out it really is their fault the radical right's been angling for that for quite some time i was able to predict it in 2015 clear